for hot and humid weather. It's coming. It sure <laughs> is. It sure is. But we've been pretty lucky. Like if you compare us to the rest of the country, right. well, you were just in it. I, I was down in South Texas, and let me tell you, <laughs> that is a that is like being in your car with the heat on, oh. like in on full, just like blowing, blowing in your face. Y'all. Everything's like, hotter in Texas, right? <laughs> bigger and <laughs> bigger and hotter, and cockroaches and crickets. There's a big difference. <laughs> if you're wondering what we're talking about, check out her social media from last night. Stuck at the airport. It's worth watching. Uh, we had uh, the chance of a couple of pop ups today. Nothing showing up on radar right now. So if you've got some evening plans, if you'd like to take advantage of the fact that it's going to be <clears throat> a little cooler this evening than it will be tomorrow. And by the way, tomorrow evening this time we'll be tracking some storms too. take full advantage. It is going to be dry. Unfortunately, we've got flash flood warnings just expiring for western sections of Kentucky where they picked up almost a foot of rain. And I mentioned we're pretty lucky. We are not dealing with the excessive heat warnings or those heat advisories that extend from the panhandle of Florida back through parts of Texas into the southwestern section of the country. In fact, about a third of our country dealing with dangerous heat. It was so warm today and a bit muggy. It's going to be hot and humid tomorrow. We have 84 degrees right now. The winds are light dew point temperatures climbing into the upper 60s. Those dew points will be in the low to mid 70s tomorrow, making it feel miserable. 84 this afternoon. We're expecting a high close to 90, but feels like temperatures 95 to 100 at times. Stay weather aware tomorrow and check back with us. We've got a severe storm threat as well, so have several ways to get warm. Keep your cell phone charged. Remember, a lot of our storms so far this season have led to power outages. Download, of course, the Live Doppler 13 weather app, especially if you're on the go, so you can get those alerts. I'm going to alert you now. It's going to be hot and humid. Feels like temperatures will near 90 by mid morning tomorrow. Be in the range of 95 to 100 at times tomorrow afternoon. What will help that? Storm chances. Unfortunately, the storm chances bring with them the threat of severe weather. Let's get to the timeline. Still may have to adjust this a little bit but we want you to stay weather aware from late morning through at least tomorrow evening. We expect to have at least one line, if not a couple of lines of storms develop and impact central Indiana with the threat of damaging winds, large hail and isolated tornadoes. All modes of severe weather in play tomorrow. We do get into a quieter weather pattern on Friday, 63 at 8 a.m. 73 midday Friday and Friday afternoon, upper 70s and low 80s with that muggy meter dropping just in time for Friday and and the upcoming weekend. High heat, high humidity, storm chances tomorrow will help you stay weather aware with that high near 90 and that severe storm threat. 82 on Friday. We'll be in the upper 50s Saturday morning, Saturday afternoon with sunshine 83. Slight storm chance Sunday afternoon, but also some sun around 84.